Morning. It's Mother's Day in Tahiti. Well, it felt good to be back in the water at Sofinus. Um, kind of tricky right now when it's kind of when it's like medium out here. Definitely not the Sofinus we were surfing two days ago. But uh, there's still a few fun ones. I hopefully the swell will be picking up a bit. Hopefully it'll get better throughout the day. But man, it's still so fun and beautiful place. Stoked to be here. And I just got lucky my first wave. That was it. I made the hit off because of that wave. I just had to like get away, try to get a turn with my big board, and which I did. And Good thing those guys uh, for me that, that they fall and they didn't pick up any, any good weight. But everybody, those guys are hardcore surfers and uh, we just got lucky with the weight. That's how it goes out there. It's about luck. Wow, so sick. I feel so happy now. The first wave, I just want to kick out and the wave just put me down and a lot of free. And yeah, I'm super stoked to take the, the last one and last minute. Yeah, I got the little barrel. So sick. Yeah. Lucky, eh? The heat before there was hardly any waves, and uh, you know, that, those south ones are coming through. And I thought, well, you know what? I want to be the first one to get one. So we went up there, and I missed every set that came through at the start. And I think I was just lucky that no one else was out there. You know, I had the inside and nah, looking for the pit. That's what that's what we want to do. Zane Schweitzer, as expected, was on great form today for the main event. He went straight into his heat and scored one of the best barrels of the day. Meanwhile, the Italian Ayrton Cosolino, he scored an epic barrel and advanced through to the third round. And the Australian contingent were on flying form today with Justin Holland leading the charge, Dave Muir advancing, but also Bo Nixon in the final heat. And finally, another standout, Noah Janela, feeling right at home here in Tahiti, winning his heat to advance through to round three. So after a beautiful day of action, it's a wrap for today, but we'll be back bright and early at 7 a.m. tomorrow morning as we get underway with round three, with a view to finishing tomorrow here at the Sappiness Pro 2015. Make sure to stay tuned to watermanleague.com for all the updates, highlights, and much more.